My fellow Australians, our country faces difficult times. An ageing population, an increasing burden of chronic disease, rising healthcare costs, workforce shortages and inequities in health. Current reforms to Australia's primary care policy have tried to tackle some of these problems. However, more needs to be done. Patients are now in increasingly complex drug regimens, requiring the use of specialised medications and multiple drugs. As a consequence of this, patients in a community are at increasing risk of medication-related problems. In fact, it's been estimated that one in 10 patients who see their GP experience an adverse drug event, with at least half of these considered moderate or severe and a staggering 8% requiring hospitalisation. The bottom line is we need to optimise medication use in primary care. Pharmacists are the drug experts and they play a key role in optimising medications use by both patients and prescribers. However, pharmacists exist on the periphery of the primary healthcare team. Collaboration between GPs and pharmacists is still sporadic, fragmented and problem focused. We need a service model which makes full use of the pharmacist's unique expertise, but also encourages meaningful and effective teamwork with other health providers to optimise patient care. So how do we do this? Well, a potential solution is the co-location of pharmacists within primary care practices. And my PhD research aims to develop and implement such a role. So firstly, in order to define the role of a practice pharmacist within a local context, we undertook a systematic review of the literature and interviews of key stakeholders. Findings from this initial phase then help guide the development and implementation of this role. And a trial is currently underway in two Victorian primary healthcare clinics. Pharmacists work on site, providing a range of different services. These include patient-directed services, such as private consultations to review medications, provide education, and assess adherence and device technique. Staff-directed services include drug information, education provided during clinical meetings, and quality assurance activities to improve quality of prescribing. These services have already resulted in great opportunities for interprofessional communication and collaboration, optimise medication outcomes and high rates of consumer satisfaction overall. The co-location of pharmacists within primary care clinics is just one way we can potentially improve the quality and safe use of medicines in Australia. So together, let's work, so together, let's fill this prescription for change and for a better tomorrow. Thank you.